What's the deal? Can't you just squeeze tighter? I popped out again. Sorry about that. The anal opening has been a bit loose lately. Open up, open up, or you'll get a kick. Uh, what's with the ghost act? What are you pretending to be? <coughs> Who are you? What, are you waiting for someone? I'm here for the excision. Whoa, this is all swollen and lumpy. It's all hemorrhoids. Take it all, stapler ready. Ah, you, you, you just cut off the whole thing in a circle. Look at all these lumps and bumps. Why would I leave them? Oh, wow, you're quite neat and clean. When can the staples come out? No big deal. You don't need to take them out. They'll slowly grow into the tissue. The stapled hemorrhoidectomy was a great success. Oh, I forgot to ask. You don't have any weird attachments, right? Now that I have staples, I won't dare mess around anymore. Bro, you never exercise. You developed flabby tummy fat. Whoa. <gasps> What is coming out? Jeez, your hardness isn't right. Oh, my bad. I stayed in the intestines a bit too long this time. All the moisture's been dried out. Bro, his tummy is bloated by several circles. You're so hard, you need to bear with it. Don't worry, I look tough on the outside, but I'm soft and sticky on the inside. The top is rushing me out again. See you next time. Ah! It hurts like hell. Uh... Mommy, Daddy was secretly eating dragon fruit behind our backs. Whoa, ho, ho. oh, I'm falling in. Come on, pull me out. <laughs> huh? Why aren't you moving? I'm stuck here. You go first. Fine then, I'm off. Bye bye. Two thousand years. <gasps> Whoa, what happened to you? You've changed. Uh, I stayed in the butt too long. I turned into a hemorrhoid tumor. And you, why are you back? Uh, nothing. Just popping by for a visit. You shouldn't stay in one place all the time. Get out and move around. Like me. Oh my, bye. So exciting. Help me. Uh, I'm out. Doctor, why do I have two eyes? Is this a second development? Given what you just said, can this video even be broadcast? Just because living conditions are good doesn't mean you can eat non-stop. You won't even give me a second to rest. What? Another one? And it's not even chewed. I haven't even finished digesting the last meal yet. Are you trying to work me to death? What kind of crappy job is this? Whoever wants to do this can do it. Hey, big bro, your stomach acid is getting pretty strong. I've been holding it back this whole time, no problem. Whoever wants to deal with it can deal with it. I'm done. If you're not gonna do your job, why should I? Screw it, I'm opening the gates. Doctor, I've been getting a lot of heartburn lately when I eat. You swallow your food without even chewing it. Your stomach doesn't have enough time to digest, so the stomach acid flows back up. Of course you have heartburn. Yo, what are you doing here? Big bro, I'm Konjak. Please take good care of me from now on. You look lumpy and gross, and you're hard to digest. Why should I care about you? I can help you lose weight. You'll definitely need me. Fine, fine. Just stay here then. I'd like to see what you can do to help me lose weight. Just watch. Huh? How did you grow so fast? It's all the water Big Bro's stomach provided for me to absorb. That's how I swell up. Not bad. Keep it up. A few moments later. You're taking up so much space. How am I supposed to eat anything else? Can't you shrink a bit? Are you still confused about your role here? I grew this big precisely so you'd eat less and finally lose some weight. Whether you can eat now is my decision. Don't get too cocky. I'll digest you eventually. That's future stuff. Right now, I call the shots. Come on, call me Big Bro. This cognac not only fills me up, but it's low in calories. It truly is a weight loss miracle. Finally, food time. Whoa, bro, 80% full is the sweet spot. Stop. Nah, we're just getting started. Keep it coming. Ugh, I'm literally about to burst. Dude, you just squirted acid all over me. Gross. Chill out, it's just a little spicy splash. I don't have mucus armor like you. I can't handle the burn. Stop stuffing your face, seriously. Yeah, yeah, future problem. 2,000 years. <laughs> I warned you for years, you never listen. Always gorging until we hurt. I'm literally cooked. I'm done for. Pops, you habitually overate for years. The constant reflux eroded everything. Your esophagus has mutated. It's cancer. Hey, why won't this stuff digest? 
<laughs> Let's just add some more acid. Oh no, it all splashed on me. What the heck? Didn't you know you'd splash stomach acid? My lining is all eroded now. You little brat. I think you're just being dramatic. Ouch, ow. Oh. <laughs> Finally, it's all digested. Bro, you can open the gate for the next meal. Uh, next meal? Uh, oh my god. Why are you being so slow? Hey! Doctor, when I eat, why do I always feel like my throat is scratchy and hurts? You have an esophagus lesion. And it's not a small one. It seems this time my stomach, I can't save it either. Here, pick one. Hey, big bro, even if the food is delicious, you can't just keep eating this much. Look at you, you're so stretched out. Exactly, the ligaments connecting us are about to snap from holding you up. Who said it? This is exhausting. What do you guys know? It's the holidays, people are feasting. This isn't just eating, it's social etiquette. What etiquette? Stop eating. I seriously can't hold on anymore. I've barely eaten anything. You guys are just a week. This is nothing. We, we can't, can't take, take it, it anymore. anymore. Hope, what's happening? Where am I falling? Hey, this isn't a good place to fall. It's not easy to get out of here. Doctor, what's wrong with me? I'm constantly nauseous and feel sick. You've been binging during the holidays, which caused the suspensory muscles and ligaments of your stomach to weaken and lose their tension. It resulted in gastroptosis or stomach has prolapsed. Haha, -ha, finally, time to sleep. <laughs> oh, I'm suffocating. Why can't I breathe? Hey, brain, are you sleeping on your back again? Why is this so restrictive? Hurry up and change your position. Fine, 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 I'll change it right away. Hang in there. Attention, all body departments, switch to sleeping on the left side. Brain, what are you thinking? How dare you sleep and crush my heart? Do you not want me to pump blood anymore? I'm telling you, keep this up and I'm going on strike. Don't panic, don't panic, adjusting immediately. Just chill, don't get angry. Come on, come on, body departments, don't rest yet. Please trouble you to move again. Switch to sleeping on the right side. Hey, brain, are you bullying my liver just because I'm easygoing? I'm here every day providing logistics for our whole company. Now when I finally get to sleep, you're crushing me again? That's a bit too much, don't you think? Fine, I'll change positions again, all right? All body departments move one more time. Sleep on the stomach. Stomach, go. No, no, I can barely breathe at all like this. Ouch. I feel terrible. I can't move. I'm being squeezed, and I haven't even finished digesting yet. This is just ridiculous. Fine, every single one of you, fine. With this much drama just to sleep, let's just stay awake then. Oh no, still not sleeping? What time is it? We don't get a break. I think you're trying to work us to death. Be careful, or we'll show you what kidney deficiency looks like. Uh, I'm so full. I'm getting dizzy. Brain, hey, brain, I gotta be. I can't hold it anymore. P, what? P, can't you see we're busy with important stuff right now? Huh, why is it blocked? I, uh, why are you so swollen? You've completely squeezed the urethra shot. Huh, I get bigger when I'm excited. You'll just have to wait. Once we're finished with the important business down here, then I'll let you pee. Who knew? Who knew? I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. Once a man passes 25, he's basically 65. Hold on. Let me check with the higher-ups. <sighs> yeah. Who is this? It's me, your little bro. Can you send some more blood down here? Two minutes should be enough. What are you waiting for? Hurry up. Hey, don't rush me. Let me just warm up a bit. hi -oh. No, can't do it. It's no use. That's it. All the excitement is gone. I'm leaving to have fun by myself. No, don't go. You should really smoke less. The harmful substances in cigarettes affect your little brother's erectile function. This kid's in his gross spurt. Every inch of him needs fuel. The whole operation depends on me. This mouth. Fine. I guess I'll just have to put in some overtime. Actually, you don't need to go that hard. Look at all this fat we've got already. What do you mean? I've got to pull double shifts to make sure he grows. You just want an excuse to eat. Well, look who it is. Hey, buddy, your little cannon hasn't grown an inch, has it? Still, the same as when we were kids. <laughs> He's mocking me. All my friends have hit their growth spurts. I need to grow bigger. I want to be a man. I want to be a man. A man. <laughs> Your obesity during puberty led to excessive estrogen production. This, in turn, stunted your development. You've missed the critical growth window. It's too late to worry about it now. 
Eat, eat, eat. Why were you so greedy? This is all your fault. You've ruined me. Does it hurt here? Yes. Usually that means there's a problem with the liver or gallbladder. <coughs> Holy moly, your liver swelling is quite serious. And there are quite a few stones in your gallbladder. Uh, this part hurts too. This area is the stomach. You have a peptic ulcer here. Also, your spleen is directly ruptured. Of course it hurts. Then this pancreas part hurts too. Enteritis. How about the lower right abdomen? Uh, acute appendicitis. How about the lower left abdomen? Colitis. And a big lump of poop you can't pass. Just my luck. This part hurts too. My heavens. The prostate is also inflamed. Doctor, how should I be treated? How about buying a guardian angel? <laughs>